Hello everyone. It is June the 2nd. It is a Saturday. It is June at last. It is so hot in here. I'm going to put my air conditioner on. What am I doing? I just took a shower. I have to clean my room a little bit because it is a disaster. I can't even like step anywhere. Um, tonight, I think I'm supposed to go to my boyfriend's house. I think. If not, it's a Saturday night. So we'll find something to do. But for now, I'm going to clean up my room a little bit going to deal with this whole situation this whole situation and yeah also quick story time as to why i'm wearing a bandaid on my finger as well as on my leg Ooh, and it's like bleeding but that's besides the point <laughs> so the other night i was watching this youtuber her name is like c jades or something and she's an awesome youtuber and her videos are funny but also scary she does a lot of like ouija board videos and all of that type thing and I'm watching one of her videos about her talking about this spirit that she's talking to on the Ouija board and as she's talking about that I'm in my room I'm trying on a pair of boots that I just got and rewind like a couple of hours prior to that I did an overnight floor set at my job and I got this like blister on my finger which was so weird but while I'm watching this creepy video I'm trying on these boots and I cut open the blister that I got from work on the pair of boots that I was trying on so then I had this huge gash on my finger, which is so gross. And then fast forward like a few minutes later, I have this like weird routine that if I use the bathroom or I do anything where I have to like wash my hands, I will wash my hands and then I will put hand sanitizer on my hands. So I do that. <laughs> completely forgetting that I have this open wound on my hand because I didn't have a band-aid on it. I go wash my hands, come into my room, put hand sanitizer on the open wound, which is, that's not blood, I think that's Neosporin actually, but I put hand sanitizer on the open wound, shake my hand because it was burning so badly, get hand sanitizer in my freaking eye. So yeah, and then on top of that, I have this huge like ingrown hair slash pimple on my thigh. And so I have to wear a band-aid on that too. So I literally have all these band-aids all over me and my life is just falling apart. I really wanted to like curl my hair a little bit tonight, but it's so hot right now. <laughs> and when it's so hot, I can't even like function to get ready. I was also gonna do like makeup, which I might still do, but I might not do um, foundation. I never wanna do foundation when it's hot out. I'm always like, oh, but like so many people like, they'll go to like music festivals and they'll still put on like foundation. And I just, I don't know if I wanna do that tonight, but maybe I'll do something a little bit different. And my family is calling me right now because even though I'm supposed to do something tonight, I still have to go and eat dinner with them. Hopefully there's like salad or something cause I'm actually not even that hungry. I had egg whites today for breakfast and an iced coffee which I ended up not finishing because for some reason I can't eat as much as I used to anymore I also can't drink as much as I used to anymore so I'm gonna go downstairs um see what everyone's doing come back upstairs and finish getting ready okay real quick before I go downstairs I was walking through my my room is a mess just just ignore it I'm walking downstairs and after the story I just told you I fucking bumped my arm and you probably can't see it but there's like a black and blue on it now I don't know, karma for some reason is like, I don't know. And I continue to watch videos about like Ouija boards and like negative energy. And then I question why I'm having all of this bad luck. But anyways, <laughs> gonna go downstairs, have something to eat, and hopefully I'll have a better rest of my night. <laughs> I'm back and I had a little bit to eat. And now I'm gonna do some makeup, my face. I took a shower, as you saw probably in the last clip. I want to just wipe off my face get those oils off i don't know does anyone else <laughs> have to wipe down their face with a makeup wipe before putting on makeup i don't know still haven't heard from my boyfriend don't know what we're doing tonight but i'm gonna put on some music and uh, do my makeup i may actually curl my hair i also don't want to wear this shirt so i gotta find another shirt to wear
are again in my room. It is the 3rd of June. I'm back with this little head thing going on. It is the next day. Last night I did end up going to my boyfriend's house um, for a little like party and then I came home, took my makeup off and went to bed. I am now fully dressed for today's events. Um, I'm going to a dinner for my two cousins. One's having a birthday the other one is having a graduation party so it's like one dinner for the two of them and yeah so we're doing this whole makeup situation again I don't really feel like filming it <laughs> because I filmed like I don't even know like an insane amount of time me doing my makeup and um I think my oh my phone was dying so I didn't even finish the look so if you follow me on like Instagram or Snapchat you saw the finished product but I'm not putting that much makeup on today anyway I'm gonna put some of this Olay cream on my face and then just yeah I wanted to edit this vlog, but I realized I never ended it, so I'm ending it now. Um, kind of a short ending, because I don't really have that much to say. Tomorrow is Monday, so it starts a whole new week of work and my internship. If I didn't already say that, I'm currently doing an internship at my school. Ow. <laughs> so, um, I'm just editing the vlog right now so what you just saw i'm editing right now and i'm going to edit go to bed and start my week i'm like a mess i should do a face mask i think that's what i'm gonna do before i go to bed i'm gonna do a face mask so yeah i hope everyone had an awesome weekend and i will see you in the next vlog bye